Two caregivers in Phoenix are facing charges after a toddler they were supposed to be watching was found dead. They claim the two year old girl fell, but doctors are calling it a case of abuse. Ryan Cody spoke with the little girl's parents about the investigation. From the bruises that you would see on her body and her face, there's no possible way that she just failed. But that's the story Taylor Slash and Shrante Renee Adams are telling about how two year old Patience Robinson died in their care. The child staying with these two while her parents, Derry and Kira, tried to get back on their feet. Derry losing his job after a stint in jail and Kira agreeing to this arrangement until they could find a permanent home. I really was okay with that. I wouldn't picture anything like this would have ever happened. Neither did the little girl's aunt Sarah, who remembers arriving before the paramedics. We looked at her from the door. We can know that she's dead because she she's in the living room on the floor, blue. And they're standing up. And she was blue and she was cold and her I seen that her face was pale. So I, I'm just, they fall, my brother fall, he on the phone with the police. Police getting there a few minutes later, saying patients had multiple injuries and doctors confirming those bruises were obvious signs of abuse. Probable cause to arrest Tayron Slash and Sharante Adams for homicide. Tayron opened the door and I seen my baby laying there on the floor. The hurt's still fresh as they watch their now former friends in court. I want to figure out what happened to the real truth that happened to my baby. Hoping for some kind of answer. I want him to serve his time and I want to figure out why.